Oh, these bracelets are made by my students. This one is from Guatemala for Melody. And Estrella made me one to balance my seven chakras. So I'm in balance today. I brought these for good luck <laughs> to help me not be nervous. <laughs> I have always wanted to be a teacher. I knew I wanted to be a teacher ever since I was little. Uh, I tried to be an engineer for a quarter, but I just wasn't as interested in it as I was with teaching. And so here I am. I am the special ed teacher. She is so easy to work with when I'm having a difficult student. The kids adore her and she makes them feel so comfortable, but also so smart. I teach my kids that everybody has something that they need to work harder on. So you just have to support each other, learn how to ask for help if you need it. And you're not competing against anybody but yourself and just um, go for growth. We actually had two students that were homeless. They were sisters. Between the two of us, those girls settled right down and um, were able to start to work. So then it comes around Christmas time and um, everybody's concerned about these girls. But Lara decided to play Santa Claus. She goes to the hotel that the family's staying in and she leaves them all of Christmas. And then the, um, you know, kind of knocks on the door and then runs and hides. And these kids come out and they're looking at all of these gifts and they start pointing to the sky and going, Santa Claus did not forget us. And uh, yeah, that's the kind of person Laura is. When I had my youngest son in my class, he has autism, I went home after the first day and I wept because the people that he was going through school with were so kind and so patient with him and they didn't talk down to him. They just understood his challenges and worked with him and worked on his talents and found the ways he was smart. She is, she is invested in kids. She loves them heart and soul, and her whole thing is if you love those kids, they are going to want to be educated. They are going to want to succeed. If she only did that for one child, she'd deserve a award, but she does it every year, <laughs> and, and, and with many children. So yeah, she deserves an award for that. I've always been a member of UEA. I feel um, very supported by our union, and um, I really like how they advocate for our students. And to be um, nominated for an award for this organization is a real honor because they represent um, the best of the best. <laughs>